So now we've got the days left and we've got our deadline. We're gonna make it a bit easier to see when our deadlines are due, just to highlight it a bit more to us. So again, we're going to the paintbrush at the top and we're adding some conditional highlighting for this. So rather than doing text like we did before, we're doing date. And you can see because it's in a date format, it automatically takes you to the date. So we're just going to highlight a few different um, parameters so we can see it. So first of all, let's start with exactly. So it, we're going to do, if the date is exactly zero days ago, which basically means if it's today, we're going to put an orange fill on it. So we can automatically see if something's due today, it's going to go orange, it's gonna tell us straight away, we need to do something about that. But we wanna add a few other rules onto there as well. So what we're going to do is we're going to do um, now a date between two dates. So we want to see um, what's between two different dates. So we can see if it's coming up in the um, last sort of week or so, coming up in the next week, then we can put it in there. So if it's between minus seven days and minus one days ago, so this is what's to go, we are going to give it a different fill color. We're going to give it a yellow fill color. So what that's telling us is if it's within the next week, it's going to give us a yellow. That's why we're doing minus numbers. So if it's the week coming up, so today's date is on here as a six. If the 12th is um, coming up, we need to know that that one needs to get done next. Um, we can also um, do a date before or a date after as well. So that tells us if it's already overdue or if it's coming up. Okay, so we can just see a few more things. So I'm going to put a red flag if it's before one day ago. This tells me that anything at this point is overdue. These are the ones that are overdue and need doing at some point soon. Um, so they're the ones that are overdue. But I can also add in a date after seven days. And that means that anything after that, I've got ages to do it. I don't need to think about it anytime soon. So any date that's after seven days is going to be our green. So it just takes a bit of fiddling around to work out exactly what you want to go at different rates, but this will just help us really highlight those dates and when they're due. Thanks for taking the time to listen all about how to make our to-do lists. Please do keep following for more information on how to use numbers.